So this, ladies and gentlemen, is a very unexpected collection selection. Do you like, do you like how my hand reached for it? And I was like, Ugh, because of the monitor. Okay, so this knife, I never thought I would actually feature in a collection selection. It is a 1000% cheap knife that I got uh, at Walmart on one of those weird days where I went to Walmart and decided I, I couldn't leave without a knife. So this was $3, legitimately $3. It was in the fishing section and it's a bait knife. And as you can tell, it's a, sort of a Mora ripoff, at least from the handle. The blade, I don't know. It's like they stole it from a, the, the kitchen section of the knife factory and s stuck it in there. But anyway, very cheap knife that I got uh, because I was being impulsive. Comes with this sort of Mora-esque sheath. Pretty nice sheath, actually, for three bucks. And I figured I'd just stick it in my toolbox and use it when I have some nasty tasks. Anyway, I just cut up all of this cardboard with this knife. And, you know, that's not crazy. That's not unexpected, considering it's a very... And it, it did a great job. And it's very thin, and it came reasonably sharp. The, the weird thing is, is that after all this cardboard, a lot of this is double-walled also, um, this thing is still really sharp. <laughs> so... I'm curious, did they accidentally put a good steel in this knife and only charge three bucks for it? Or is it just because it's just such a cheesy piece of crap? But is it a piece of crap? I guess not. It worked great for this purpose. Um, and I guess for cutting up worms and squid or whatever you use for your bait, it would also be good. Um, anyway, just thought I'd share the knowledge. This. Uh, this cheap $3 bait knife from Walmart is excellent if you have some undesirable tasks that you that you don't want to put your other knives to, uh, to work on. So that's about it. Check it out. Anonymous $3 Chinese Walmart bait knife. Great for cardboard.